Hey guys, Caleb's Cards here, coming at you with a Monday Mail Day today with several TTMs, uh, a quick eBay pickup, and a care package from a friend, a uh, Christmas package also as well. Um, so without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this. Uh, I'm going to start off with the eBay pickup. I uh, bought this with my eBay buck, so it was basically free. Just had to pay a little bit for shipping. Uh, this guy, I believe, has passed on was a pretty good pitcher um, for the Indians Herb score got this card that I believe was from a TTM so uh, did not have him in my collection yet so I figured I'd pick it up it was a pretty decent price uh, these are kind of just going to be all out, all over the place um, just in exact order I opened them up um, Got former Vancouver Canuck hockey player Greg Adams. The 4x6. Former golfer, he lives here in Colorado. Craig Stadler. Took uh, about a month or so. Oh, this one was really cool. Um, saw he was signing. He's in his 90s now. I I think he was on the list of World War II veterans. I'm not 100% sure. He didn't have a whole lot on his Wikipedia page, but uh, he was inducted into that in the NASCAR Hall of Fame in 2012. Glenn Wood. So that is really cool. He's about 91, 92 years old. He also included a business card. Uh, let me just signed it let me just cover up the email so that is really cool Glenwood and I, I think he was a World War II veteran so the racing collection is looking pretty nice within the last two weeks um, this one's been out since October former Buffalo Bills safety played for them for a while was a pretty decent player on a Hewitt graphs uh, Tony Green I uh, did not have a card for him I sent one of these. Um, I used to at some point <laughs> when I collected cards more often. Uh, this next one's really cool. Uh, World War II veteran William Phelps. He was in the Battle of the Bulge and uh, he sent a really nice letter and an extra photo. Uh, he, he gave me his phone number too and his email. But uh, just one, and uh, they mentioned in the letter that uh, him and his daughter. I uh, went and checked out my Facebook and my YouTube channel, and they thought I was doing a really nice job and uh, thanked me for uh, recognizing veterans and stuff. So that's that's really, truly an honor that he would uh, take the time out of his day to do that. So that is really cool, Mr. Phelps. And again, thank you for your service if you happen to see this video, and I really appreciate it. So that's awesome to hear feedback when I uh, get a real letter back saying somebody went and checked out my, my uh, collection and stuff. So that's really cool. So uh, he signed a Hewitt Graphs, sweet spot in there, love it, and uh, he included this photo, um, he mentioned that Dwight D. Eisenhower came and visited his unit, and he was uh, a first sergeant in that unit, and uh, Eisenhower, uh, or he uh, gave a tour to General Eisenhower, and uh, I guess he was the first first sergeant to have lunch with him so that's pretty cool historical fact there and here's the photo of General Eisenhower so that's really cool so thank you so much Mr. Phelps I'll have to write him a thank you email or a thank you card or something so that's really really cool it's been a while since I had a World War II vet come in so and technically we got two um, this guy I sent two for the hit the deck contest um, I'm on the fence whether they're real or not um, they're not auto pen because they are different. I sent two photos just to be able to rule that out. Uh, doesn't necessarily, you know, eliminate ghost signing or secretarial. But then again, it's such a simple signature that I don't see why he couldn't sign. <laughs> but uh, I sent the Tim Allen. I got him signed a Buzz Lightyear photo. So as you can see, just a T and an A. <laughs> Sort of a T, sort of looks like a T and A, but uh, and then I sent this 
home improvement. I think I might try and send a Richard Karn since I just got him to sign that blank photo one time. So we'll see. I might send that out to him because he is a pretty good signer too. Well, we'll see. Um, next up, I wasn't sure if this one's coming back. This has been out for November, October as well. Uh, Giada de Laurentis has her own cooking channel. I used to watch her years ago when I was wanting to do cooking. Not so much anymore. <laughs> well, that's pretty cool. Uh, I got a couple business cards that came in from email from uh, Sh uh, Charlotte Men's Basketball. Uh, they're the 49ers there, Mark Price. I'm just going to show one of them that he signed the back. Just don't want to show off his personal email and phone number. Just out of respect to him. So he signed. They're both the exact same, so that was cool. That came in really quick. Uh, this one came in fashion, I thought, too, as well. Really good basketball player in the 80s and 90s. From Germany, Detlef Schrempf. Also came with a letter saying, please do not you know, sell these or not, which I'm not, so very cool. And then final TTM, 77 and 78 tops of former pitcher Pete Roberg and or the facsimile and 78 for the collection so really nice TTMs and then the Christmas slash care package it's coming from uh, Brandon Brandon Paxton he's a guy I met on sports card forum uh, he's in the Air Force currently so I talked to him quite regularly on Facebook I sent a card of Eugene Richardson Uh, autograph of Rocky's outfielder. Uh, I don't believe he's with us anymore. Uh, Cole Garner, but I do re remember that name. He also included this card of Robin Yount, which I do not have. Wonder Wonder Stars. It's from Wonder Bread. That was really cool. Here's a Christmas card he sent. Star Wars. And uh, he sent this IP Auto that he got uh, from. Kansas City's Chiefs training camp, uh, Ryan Suckup. So that's really cool. So thank you so much, Brandon. He also included the guide from the camp he got it from. So that's really cool. You did not have to do this, man. I um, really appreciate it and uh, getting to know you for the past, oh, I think, almost two years now, if not two years. Time has kind of flown by. So uh, we both share common interests with the World War II veterans and stuff. So it's really cool. So thanks so much, and uh, thanks to everybody who signed for me today, and uh, hopefully I'll be back with a few more tomorrow, and uh, talk to you later, guys. Have a great day.